Legal scholars and people of goodwill can argue as to whether Derek Chauvin was overcharged or as to whether it was possible for him to ever receive a fair trial. Be that as it may, the evidence strongly suggests that some measure of justice was obtained. But President Biden's remarks following the verdict were an absolute disgrace. Here's just a portion of what he said. Systemic racism is a stain on our nation's soul. <clears throat> the knee on the neck of justice for black Americans. The murder of George Floyd launched a summer of protest we hadn't seen since the civil rights era in the 60s. Protests that unified people of every race and generation in peace and with purpose. Let's take those statements in order. The term systemic racism is an irresponsible blanket indictment. It's pure sophistry designed to put good people on the defensive. A systemically racist country whose population is only 13 percent black doesn't twice elect a black man as president, pure and simple. And no, people of every race and generation were not unified by the protests, read riots, that broke out in cities across the country last summer. People were killed. Businesses, many of them black-owned, were destroyed. Riots don't happen in peace. Taken all around, Derek Chauvin got what he deserved from a jury. That's more than we can say we got from the President of the United States. That's my word. What's yours? Go to youtellmetexas.com and you tell me.